Hey you guys and welcome back to Sophia Monet Tarot. It's your girl Sophia Monet. I'm here to do your weekly readings for July 20th through the 27th and we are now on Virgo. All right Virgo, so let's see what <clears throat> spirit <clears throat> excuse me, what spirit has to say <laughs> to you for this week. This is for Virgo Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars and Jupiter. Spirits, ancestors, guys. Divine spirit, Holy Spirit. Please give me accurate messages for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, and Jupiter. What's their energy for this week? What do they need to hear? And what do they need to know? This is for Virgo. This is for Virgo. At the bottom of the deck, we have memories of love. So you could definitely be missing someone this week. Um, this could have to do with a romantic situation, or if this is not about romance, then you could definitely just be missing like a friend or missing going out with friends. Cause a lot of us are still on lockdown or still, still experiencing the effects of quarantine and you may be at a distance from someone. So you may just be missing your friends, you know, or missing family. Um, right here we have spiritual strength. We also have sacral chakra, which means creativity and sexuality. And we also have, have transformation. So I feel like this week you are really in a place where you're needing spiritual guidance. I feel like a lot of you may have fallen off from your spirituality or consulting with your spirit guides. A lot of you have fallen off from that. Maybe you've just been focused on, you know, the past and thinking of the past. And this has really hurt you, you know, thinking about stuff from the past, especially if this has to do with the love relationship. Some of you could be thinking about your children. Maybe you're separated from your children or maybe, um, your children are not with you. Maybe you don't have custody of your kids. There's something about children as well that I'm getting for this week that you you may be trying to be strong, but it's hard for you. And with that sacral chakra being there, I feel like you are trying to transform. You're trying to become a better person. You're trying to reinvent yourself. That's the word I hear, reinvent you're trying to reinvent yourself, but you're finding it hard to do. A lot of you are stuck in the memories of your past. Yeah, see here, page of pentacles reversed. That flipped out in reverse just now. <clears throat> so yeah, I feel like you, you're just not, wow, these cards are just like busting out. Let's see what's going on here. That was a whole chunk, but I'll go with it. We have the eight of cups, meaning you had to leave a family situation. The five, the, I'm sorry, the 10 of cups. We have the death card, which is the transformation card over here. Yeah, something ended with a, a, a definitely a situation that had you emotional Mm, yeah, Ace of Cups. Then we have the Tower card. Two of Swords. And then the King of Cups. So something that's telling me that something had you very emotional. Something that you had to walk away from. It could have been a family. It could have been a relationship. You had to end something. And you're trying to reinvent yourself. You're trying to move forward from this pain that you had to go through or that you had to endure, but you had to make a decision. And some of this, um, some of this energy, this could have been with your father. Some of you could have lost a father or be putting a father to rest. And if you are my condolences to you for anyone who has lost a father or a father figure, some of you may be struggling with being a father. You may have just found out that you're a dad. Um, or some of you could have found out that you're pregnant and you're trying to figure out how to tell your 
partner or significant other is what I'm getting. A lot of messages are coming through for you, Virgo, because there are a lot of Virgos I'm, I'm reading for. But there's a lot of different situations. Some of you, you don't know how to leave your children behind and you're having a hard time um, if there's been a divorce or a separation, it, you're having a hard time leaving the kids. And you could be going through some type of battle or struggle with the children. A lot of child energy is coming through. With pregnancy, um, there could have been a hidden pregnancy or just something that you weren't expecting with a pregnancy is what I'm feeling for this week. If it's not this week, then it's coming because I feel it so strongly here. But yeah, something is, your life will not be the same moving forward. That's what I'm feeling. So you're you're being stuck in the, the, in the past, wanting things to be the, how they used to be and your life is changing and it's hard to make those changes. Alrighty, Virgo. So this is the energy I'm getting for you for this week. If you would like a personal reading, my information is below. Please hit your girl up and uh, see how to obtain those personal readings, okay? I look forward to hearing from you and I hope you have a great week, Virgo. Bye.